Hopefully everything's good so far. Gonna turn on my window AC thing. <sighs> we'll be getting started in just a little while, everybody. We'll be getting started around the four minute mark on the elapsed stream time thing, so until that time, after you, you know, get thyself prepared and um, we'll get into the game real soon, hopefully. And thank you, Stream Elements, for doing your part in the chat pretty early. I'm not so appreciated. Oh, excuse me. Oh, oh. Yeah, he's going to wait until the four minute mark and, you know, give it some time to, you know, see if, see if people come in and all that stuff, you know, see if any notifications, you know, go out. I'm really hoping and praying that Stream Elements actually did its thing uh, where it's supposed to send out a, tw uh, a tweet um, to my Twitter, but... I still don't know how that works because like it's it's done it's done like a couple of times and then all of a sudden it's like now we're not doing it. So I don't I don't know what the hell's going on. Overall though it is annoying. Hopefully everything, you know, plays out nicely. I am doing this. I am doing this via game capture, instead of like um, in like a in like a area capture like I do sometimes. And hopefully, you know, chat manager, um. You know, does its thing to where, like, if anything, uh, if anyone, you know, chats in my, in my stream while I'm, you know, live and all that stuff, that, um, you know, I can be able to, I can be able to take notice of it. But we'll see what happens. I don't, I honestly don't, like, expect a whole lot of people to show up for the stream, but, you know, stranger things have happened, more or less. <laughs> <sighs> All right, it is now it is now past the four minute mark, and since Stream Elements has done its thing, I'll do my thing, which is my intro. So, hey, all my fellow Rumble maniacs, it's Mr. Rumble Roses here, and welcome back to some more Doom 64 EX mods. And today we're going to be continuing more of Doom 64 Reloaded. Um, in the last stream, we managed to uh, we, we managed to solve the mystery of um, one of the secret levels that we went to. Unfortunately, we could not get a, we could not get the demon key because I think it was like an, I think it was like in a brand new level, and I didn't really know how to um, to solve the puzzle or whatever it was to get the key because. Um, you know, it's 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 new. Like it's pretty much like a new new take on new sixty four in a way, I guess. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. <coughs> <coughs> but but um, we made it to Alpha Quadrant, albeit we are a little bit banged up because right now we're about like a twenty two health um and everything, but. 
We're gonna try and see how much we can be able to do uh, in this stream. We're probably gonna go. We're probably gonna go for about like maybe two hours or so. Yeah, it depends. Um, but yeah. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, but sorry if I'm sounding like a little gassy. I kind of had me some dinner uh, a, a while ago. But before we go on, but before we um, start to start to you know the game or whatever. There are some things that I kind of want to talk about, and it's pretty much how, my, how I'm doing how I'm doing this playstyle. So, the 64 EX basically has, you know, some options where you can be able to, you know, like for example, one you can build a jump, and two you can be able to free look and all that stuff. Now, I know that now I, I know this from from experience because I I, I used to play the game back in the day. You know, played it on and all that stuff. But I know that originally Doom 64, you know, had no jumping and no free looking. So it's pretty much, you know, um, you have to use the environment to your advantage. And also, um, you know, you have to pretty much, you know, just be, you know, just looking left and right instead of looking up and down. Now... Some could say that, like, you know, that kind of breaks the sequence or breaks this or breaks that or whatever. And I was going to say this. You know, this is this is the year 2021. You know, this ain't, the, this ain't you know, like, around, like, the 1990s or so. Or like, whenever, whenever Doom 64 came out, you know, like, this ain't that time. You know, like, this ain't, you know, this ain't, this ain't like, you know, you're at your normal Doom 64, you know. Because... You know, we have a whole bunch of options and stuff like that, you know. And knowing the fact that, like, you know, we have the ability to, you know, do something simple like, you know, jumping or, you know, free looking and all that stuff. I'm just going to say this right now, you know, whether you want to agree, with, whether you want to disagree with me or not. I don't think that, you know, having these abilities counts as, like, cheating or breaking or abusing, you know, anything. You know, because it's built, it's it's implemented into the game. It's implemented into the um the engine. I know, so I, I know from and from what I've heard, I know that um was it was it in Kaiser or whatever um said that he implemented jumping the the jumping ability in Doom 64 EX for like you know custom maps and stuff like that for people who um you know make maps. That requires some sort of jumping, and I know for a fact that you know I know for and I know for a fact, and I'm pretty sure Atomic you know maybe watching this later on or something like that. But like I know for a fact that um, you know this is pretty much like a new take on the Doom 64 maps, and you know but but he still has like the um, the spirit of like you know being able to get to stuff. Uh, by normal means, you know, stuff like, you know, using the jumping ability or free looking ability and stuff like that. But I've kind of had an idea as to what I'm going to do for like this, for like this mod. Because this is basically a, because this is basically the full release, even though it's still early access in some cases, because I was granted early access to play this mod uh, for you guys. Um, I will be doing at least two playthroughs of this. My current playthrough right now, I'm doing it my way. Like, you know, I'm doing, I'm doing it my way, the way I want to, you know, using anything to my advantage. And I just saw Twitch now doing the thing. I kind of forgot to turn it off. But, oh well. Um, but what I'm pretty much going to be doing is I'm going to be playing it my way. I'm going to be having the ability to jump in certain cases. I'm going to be having the ability to free look, you know, here and there. Especially, you know, to like, uh, you know, especially to like, you know, take in the environment, take like in the, you know, the, the, the remastered map looking design, stuff like that. And afterwards, I will, and, now, and then after I do, and, and after I manage to beat this, um, I will be doing a second playthrough in the future, at least, where I play this game normally. You know, like, no jumping and no free looking and stuff like that, but... You know, like, I, I guess you could say, like, the way that I'm doing it right now is pretty much like a modern way of playing Doom 64. The second way I'm going to be playing this in the future 
is classic style. So. Two hell nights. Yeah, do that. Get the yellow key. Let's get a little backpack out of it too. I need me some health. Ow. Actually, you know what? Let's take it from the top again, shall we? Triple kill. Alright. We're gonna make a new save. Call it reloaded full three. Because this is the third stream. Um, I'm doing a, a, the full release of this mod. Actually, we'll save it right here, since you know, we got a little bit more better health. Now I know what you guys now I know what some of you guys probably think. You're probably thinking, um, how come you're doing your stream at a later time than normal? Well, there's about two reasons for that. One, my st my stream schedule this week is kind of borked. I'm not gonna go into detail, but I will say again it's nothing serious. Um, but also I found out that um, a friend of mine apparently was having some I guess he's having like some major storm issues and it's kind of fucking with his, um, it's kind of like fucking with his internet stuff like that. Uh, it's, it, it's going through like a storm apparently and the internet's getting a bit iffy for him. Ow. So, he apparently had decided to cancel his stream and, um, So I decided to, you know, do the stream for you guys and, you know, try to get more of this mod uh, done in progression and everything. Hang on. Um, I'm going to do something real quick, so just give me a moment. It's kind of realized something. Oh uh, yeah, that's probably that's probably why. <laughs> I am an idiot. 
that's probably that's probably why I was um a bit iffy on like the, like the feel of it you know because like I I was I was on my stream manager and and apparently like I forgot to close it because I wouldn't because I wasn't sure like how today I, I wasn't sure how tonight was going to go you know and stuff like that. Hopefully, you know, everything's still good. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of a thing, you know, like, I can't really have, um, I can't really have, like, my stream manager off when I'm trying to stream and stuff like that, because I don't have the best connection. I don't have, like, the best stuff in the world. Nah, it's a Hell Knight. There, that's a Baron. I don't know why I keep confusing Baron and Hell Knight for some reason. <sighs> yeah, like, Hell Knights are, Hell Knights are green, Barons are red. Forgive me if I don't remember correctly, because it's been such a long time since I played the original Doom 64, and you know, having you know the whole situation of where you, know, you can't build a jump and everything. But I think that there's obviously a way that you can build to get in here. You know, I, I, you know, by normal means. Yeah. Yeah, look at it, look, it, look at that face though on the uh, look at that face though. It's it, it makes you it makes you wonder like you know where did, where did they where did they get you know this the, 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 that that thing from? I mean like you know. Well. As I said, this is my playthrough, and yeah, I'm doing things my way, so... Maybe in the future I'll figure out, like, you know, how to get that normally. But, well, overall though, this is basically, again, a casual playthrough. You know, even though, even though I am playing on Watch Me Die, AKA like the equivalent of ultra violence in Doom 64 because well uh, the mod maker Atomic Frog had I guess you could say quote unquote suggested that I play it that way. Yeah. Ow. That's something I never understand in the game with Doom 64, especially like um, it, when it comes to like the Hell Knights and everything. Um, you know, like they they obviously bleed green, but when you shoot them, they bleed red. <laughs> Maybe a random oversight or something like that. I don't know. 
I mean, I, I do, I mean, like, I do kind of know that, like, in some situations, you know, there are some doom enemies, you know, that, that actually, like, bleed certain colors, but they still have, you know, like, the redness in them, if that makes any sense. Okay, so we got some spawn stuff. Ow. That's done. I don't know why, but I thought there was like a... I thought there was a, um... Like a zombie mode or shotgunner right there. Okay, the one thing I will say that I do like about this mod, and I, I may have already talked about it, but I'll say it again for the hell of it. I do like the fact that in this mod, uh, the zombie men and shotgunners actually have a color difference between them. Because in Doom 64 originally, um, the zombie men and the shotgunners, they both share the same sprite. So you never really could, you never really could know exactly as to uh, what was what until like you know they shot at you. Ow. Yeah, you know, so like for example, like you know if you if you play if you play a Doom 64 normally and you came across with you know one like like a shotgunner, you wouldn't know until it did its um. It, it pretty much shot, it shot its weapon. You know, like, it would, you wouldn't know, and, you know, unless, until it shot its weapon, and, you know, most likely it took damage. Can you not? <laughs> wow! A bear in a hell night in fighting. You gotta love it. Reload that. If someone can, if someone can clip that, uh, that that infighting between the Hell Knight and Baron, that would be much appreciated. I know it probably won't happen on, I know it probably won't happen on, like, on stream, but, you know, if someone did it off stream, you know, that would, that would be much appreciated. <sighs> okay, so what happens, okay, so what normally happens right here, is if you hit the switch, um, there's gonna be like a, you know there's gonna be like a little bridge that would come up. Um, let me let me go let me go down and I'll show you guys. So normally what would happen is you'll get a bridge that go from here to here and then here to there I think and then it, basically you get like a bridge you know to where you can like, hit these switches and then uh, get over here. 
that's where you have to go in order to get the um the blue key. Which is right here. Blue, blue key door. I can't remember. I think you're supposed to like I, I think like you're supposed to uh, I don't know if you're supposed to do something that's supposed to make this door open. Cause you got, cause you gotta pretty much, you know, you, you gotta raise that thing up. Cause if you don't raise it up, then you're pretty much gonna get blocked. See? Yeah, so now, so now with that thing up, we got to actually make our way where we need to go. here and ow So yeah, there's the blue key, and we got to be able to, um, we got to hit a switch in a different room in order to get that opened. And there's some super armor, which, honestly, I forget how you're supposed to get that. Like, I think, I, I kind of think like there's supposed to be like another switch or something, probably in the same little area, but... Is he not aggro? Is he just, is he just, you know, just chilling? There you go. I was about to say, like, what kept you there, bruh? Switch open up that area. Ow. Game would you quit the lag?
God, I hate those things. Run. Damn it. Kinda of forgot. And I'm... I gotta remember, this ain't... This doesn't do a thing. This doesn't do the thing where it reloads your save after you die. You gotta do that manually. It's black screen. Can you not see? Can, is, can can the game not be seen, Maverick? Because I'm doing I'm doing in-game capture, but I don't know if it's, I don't know how uh, I don't know how it is for um, for you for the viewer. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> you you kind you kind of gave me a you kind of gave me a scare there, Maverick. Just came in to see a dark level, but yeah, yeah. This level, this, some of these levels can be pretty dark as far as like lighting goes and stuff like that, you know. But I think I think in some I think in some situations, um, probably like Doom sixty four reloaded. Um, I think like. I think like the mod creator may have darkened some of the levels more than normal. Yeah. So you probably you probably came in you, you probably came in right when I went right when I died to a pain elemental and it was re, it was pretty much restarting me from the on the level with nothing but my pistol. So that's probably what you saw. So yeah, you better pretty much go over here, you know, and there normally like this. Things will raise, but it's totally fine. down here but I don't know if I really want to go down there like I, I, like you can, you can see like there's an atomic there's a uh, not an atomic a um, a berserk down there but I don't really feel like getting it I won't get that though Yeah, it's good to see you, Maverick. Um, you know, hopefully, hopefully you're having a good night. I know, I know that this, I know that the stream uh, is is do, I'm no, I know I'm doing the stream later than normal. Uh, but again, you know, like my my schedule this week is kind of borked as far as like streaming during my normal time. And I found out that my friend, uh, he's apparently going to like a, I guess like a major storm or something like that. And it's all, it's kind of, it's kind of fucking with the internet capabilities, you know. It's so like um, so, ba so like basically his stream connect like his internet connection is uh is kind of weak, so it's more it's more than likely going to affect his streaming ability. So I kind of decided to um, so so I kind of decided to you know. Uh, do my stream do, like I said I decided to do a stream uh, tonight and everything since you know 
I don't, have, I don't really have much to worry about as far as like, you know, being bothered or whatever. Oh, I see the, uh, see the blue key card back, back there. Yeah. You know, hopefully everything. Yeah, hopefully everything goes well with this stream and everything. Um, again, I am doing an in-game capture instead of doing like a area screen area screen recording. If that makes any sense. So. combination and yeah I'm a, I also I made, a, I made a new save just in case you know anything happens <clears throat> yeah hopefully hopefully you'll be able to stick around for the, you know the whole stream and everything but I, I, but I can understand you know like if um, you know maybe get it may get late Hey, 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 hey! Damn the lost soul. Hmm. Interesting. So wait, did the did the blue key go to the floor, or is there somehow two of them? I think I'm gonna sneeze. Ugh. Excuse me. Oh, that's probably that's probably why I saw the that's probably why I saw it. Okay. Thank you. I was about to say like I, I was about to say like I I, I wonder I, I was wondering why I saw the blue key card um, like so close to where I spawn, and yeah, it makes sense. And like normally the blue key card would would be right there. <clears throat> so <sighs> yeah normally what you would do um, you basically would make like a little bridge that you know that's pretty much you know, takes up this little portion of the uh, of the room you would get you know go up there and you get the uh, blue key card that way. Yeah, they're almost gonna move for some reason. Now I could probably, you know, actually jump and, you know, do the thing. Cause I've done, I've done this normal, I've done this before normally, so you know, so like you can go pretty much, you know, go over here, get the blue key card, I'll see the soul sphere. But I will, I will show you guys. You know, especially for, for the newcomers that never really played uh, Doom 64 originally, how you normally would do it.
Again, like I said, you know, I could play this my way, you know, with the with you know everything in play, you know, like with the jumping and the free look, but you know it would pretty much be like my choice if I wanted to, you know use one thing or another. Now this right here um, is pretty much a button. It's, it's a time button. It's it's pretty much a time button that allows you to go in to, to open the area up to get the uh, the, super, the blue armor. If you don't have you know stuff in your way, you know then you could be able to. Um, Sales for it. But yeah, overall though, like Doom 64 Reloaded, you know, like it, it has like some changes done to it here and there. But if you've ever played the original Doom 64, um, a good portion of this stuff will be familiar to you. camera you know the camera area to show you uh, the area where the blue keys at you know right now by normal means besides you know jumping you can build get to it at this and you got to shift a little bridge Supercharge, whatever, whatever you want to call that. <coughs> now that sound means that something has spawned, most likely out out in the out in the uh, out in the open area. And even there. Plasma. Ow. Whoa, hello. Yeah. Sorry, sorry if the uh, stream may, if the game may be a little bit iffy at times. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know why it does that. Like, some, like I, I don't know why it's like, you know, whenever you try and stream something, you know, sometimes you get, you get like the random lag moments or freezing moments and stuff like that, but off stream, like everything's, you know, completely fine. Okay, we'll need to lower those things. Don't you just love it when there's a fucking, like, big enemy that you have to deal with? Ow.
So yeah, that, 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 this is another little situation where you have to um, make a bridge right there. Make a little bridge, get to the exit, and go on to the next level. that area and we can well go in that area now <coughs> and I do believe that takes us to another key presumably probably the yellow one I got lucky there. That looks like it, that that looks like it could be a button for something, but I know it can also be I know it can also probably be you know just decoration. You bitch! Quit shooting me! Wee! <laughs> now normally I would be playing the not so I can I fucking, you know, move. Now normally when it comes to this game, um, I would be playing it with a uh, controller. Because, well, I, I like to play a lot some of my games with controller if I had the ability. But for this playthrough, and even the next, um, uh, well, maybe not the next, but definitely for this playthrough, um, I am uh, I am attempting to try and play this game with keyboard and mouse. <laughs> oh yeah, then go uh, over here. Hit this button right now. Once again, Lost Souls and Do 64 are aggressive. Like, you know, even even though like you can, even though like most of the time you can be able to, um, you know, like what, like possibly one shot a um, a Lost Soul with, with, with your normal shotgun. Um, they, like what they lack in health, they make up for in aggression. Alright, so now I'm get a little camera view of that area. And now that area is opened up. <laughs> and I might as well save my game right here.
for some reason I thought like maybe we had skipped maps or like the map ordering was a little bit weird or something. I don't know. That way either. I'm gonna go here. Cause this pretty much is the thing that should allow us to um, raise up to raise up a little bridge path to make our way to the exit. And of course, it's gonna be a fucking barren. You know what? The fuck are you? For a minute, I thought I was gonna lag so far, so far out of the, out of the bridge. Nope. No, thank you. Final outpost. And yeah, another, another, another one, one of the cool things that I kind of like about Doom 64 Reloaded is that 9 times out of 10, um, there's always like a nice little transition uh, from, from the level that you're, from one level to the next. You know, like, you know, you gotta get a little bit of a taste or something like that with, um, you know, the, the level. Oh nice, you actually put a, you actually put a, um, you actually put a little switch right here. Okay. For one, I want to save that. Now I can't remember, I can't remember how it was done because I don't know like the, the original uh, formula. But I think like what you have, what you normally have to do is like you have to like go around one of these corners or something like that and. You know, possibly have that have that area lowered so we can actually get over here. I don't know this little area right here. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna this is gonna pretty much like lead you into like a little bit of a trap. Good. <laughs> hey Maverick, can you try and clip this please? I'm like right on top I'm like right on top of this uh this zombie man and he is not and he can't he can't hurt me at all. Oh, that's too funny. Like he, 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 it seems like he can't move, and all he's trying, to, and, and, and the only thing he can really do is just shoot me. <laughs> uh, see if you, see how much. Try to get as much of that as you can, like you know, leading up to leading up to that moment, to this moment right here. You know what, I actually want to save it right here. Yeah, even I can't seem to hit him. But 
that will do. <laughs> splash, splash damage can do. Ah, uh, at times like this, I wish Doom 64 he had, he had kind of a, uh, an ability to crouch. Oh well. But that was, that was funny though. I, uh, I got a good laugh out of that. Alright. to uh, uh, put you put you in there <laughs> which I honestly wouldn't be surprised if he if, if that was his plan I'll switch to me chain gun so cool if like um if we had the ability to crouch on crouch in this game or port or whatever because um it would have been funny to actually be able to get you know a little bit closer to um to the zombie moon ow alright blue key Making this water glow, are we? Just... Yeah, the one, the one, the way that you normally would have to um, uh, get this to lower is you pretty much have to go like over there and then make, then like make your way over here as fast as possible. Where the hell did you put these here? Can I get this? Okay. You cannot get it jumping. 
Cause I think I think like and I I don't know this I don't know this 100 for sure. But I think like when it comes to Doom and like classic Doom and Doom 64, um, the jumping is a little bit iffy sometimes. Like I think there's like a bit of a height difference maybe. But I don't know. God damn, it's hard to see it. Now. Man can hardly see anything at all. So damn, Atomic, why'd you have to make this area so damn dark? Okay. That was an Alchihuahua moment right there. Well, better before we lock in. Damn, it's hard to see up in here. Fucking that, but some fucking uh, light amplification goggles would be nice. I think something's gonna be in that room, in that little room. Oh, hello there, Mr. Arachnatron. I do believe you're not supposed to be in here. Like, oh, dude, declare you're not supposed to be in that in this little area. Ow! That hurt. I was looking real dirty breath. Like, you seen that shit, Maverick? Took me down to fucking 14 health. Wait a minute. Oh, thank God. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay. I, for, for some reason, I thought that this was like a backpack or something. But apparently it was just a dead marine. Whoa!
Road match. Clear out this room. So yeah, this th this right here, this is probably one of, if not the most annoying little um, puzzle thing that you have to do in order to get the key. So you know, you look in here, you see like these two switches, right? Well, hello there, Mugen. Welcome to my late night stream. How are you do how are you doing today? It's it's been a while. I I I think it's been a while since I've seen you around. Yeah, like you, you know, you see these two switches here? They pretty much mean jack shit. Finishing my streaming soon. Yep, Doom 64 EX. Um, I am playing a mod called Doom 64 Reloaded, made by made by a user named Atomic Frog. Um, I was given early access to the full release, and he has allowed me to play it for you guys on stream, and you know, show what the uh, full experience is going to be. So that's why there's so that's why there's an area. Sticky for sticky. I put them back up for some reason. <sighs> but yeah, um, yeah, but yeah, because you probably haven't been able to be, be around and everything. Uh, this is this is a mod again called Do 64 EX. Oh, this is. I am so stupid. This is a Do 64 EX mod called Do 64 Reloaded, made by Atomic Frog. Um, there are some changes done to a lot of the levels, and there's also like some new levels to play around with as well. Um, I guess you could say this, that this is kind of like a second take of like Doom 64. You know, like if um, you know, you had like a second experience or something like that. You know, uh, some if not all the layout of the levels that you play are going to be somewhat new, but if you are familiar with Doom 64. Uh, some things are going to be familiar to you. And, um, I'm currently trying to do more of this, of this mod and see how much, uh, I can go and do. Okay, that's going to be a trap. As soon as I get that, that, uh, soul sphere, um, I feel like a hell not, uh, Baron's going to, uh, appear. Yeah. Yeah. Very little, but but yeah, very sneaky here, Atomic. Like I like as soon as, as soon as I saw this area, as soon as I saw like the uh, the wall texture, like how like it like it was, I'm like, oh yeah, this is this feels like it's gonna be like a door or something. Like you know, it's gonna be like either like a trap or um, you know, like a secret like a secret or something. This right here though is um is nice. A little like a little um like a little uh, shape of the demon key thing. Or do or Doom 64 um like logo in a way. Except you know it doesn't have Doom Except it doesn't have Doom on it. Why did I go over here? I did not want to go that way. Yeah, overall though, like it's it's been pretty fun. It's been pretty fun um, playing um, some of these levels again because 
I know, because I don't know how, I don't know if you're, if you're, if you were ever around, um, but I actually did play the demo of this mod a while back, and as mentioned, um, I was given early access to the full release. Ow! Oh, so he's gonna throw a Hell Knight and a Baron at me, huh? I'll figure out what it is. Ew. You bitch. Okay. Save it right here. So I don't have to deal with it. Mr. Uh, uh, Baron Boy again. Let's see if I can do better. But actually, first, I'm gonna go down here because this is where I was wanting to go a moment ago, but I had to deal with this boy. Ow! That was done so badly! stuff and things up in here. Anyone else want some? Seeing it. Oh, there is nothing really up here. Because normally what's supposed to because normally what's supposed to happen is. Oh wait, I rem I remember now. I'm an idiot. So yeah, you hit the switch, the plasma gun will disappear, and you gotta find like where it's at. I think you get like a few. I think you, I think you get like a few attempts, and if you don't get if you don't get it right, um, then I think you get I think you kind of get locked out from trying to get the uh, the plasma gun. So that was always interesting, interesting but overall annoying. <laughs> Hopefully my stream. Hopefully the stream's still going good for everyone, and also hopefully you know, one join the stream so far. Again, I know I know that this is a late stream. I know that I didn't really announce it to anyone, but you know I. I but you know, due to, you know due to you know certain different circumstances and whatnot, I um. Yeah, like you know, due to certain circumstances and stuff like that, I I wanted to actually do another stream uh, for you guys because technically this is because technically this is my active streaming week. Although the streaming schedule is a little bit bored, you know, it's still something, you know. Okay, so now we're gonna go out here. I 
me a whole bunch of nightmare rounds. A nightmare anything in this in this game and it's quite annoying. Ow. Hey, whoop the right into that shit. Hit him, god damn. Ow. No, thank you. Move, 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 move. I don't know for sure, but I think I heard, I think I might have heard attack a demon. Indeed I did. It's like, I did, I did, I did hear attack a demon. I think I gotta kill all the all the barons, and um, I think I gotta kill all the barons, and then like some platform stuff will, will rise up, and I can go to get to that teleporter. Fucking itchy nose. Shit again, Atomic. Question is, was that what did the, what did that do? To be honest, I can't remember. I can't remember what I can't remember what Atomic told me about that switch. I think like it, I think like it was supposed to actually do something. But I don't know if it's like you know, I, but I, but like I don't know if it's like on a timer type of thing or something in the level has you know been opened or altered or something. I'm pretty sure Atomic can tell me on Discord somehow. 
Because cause honestly, because honestly, in my opinion, I mean, um, I don't know how many, I don't know how many like mods and stuff that Tom McFrog has made over the years, but just by knowing him and you know, like how and how is um and just how he is sometimes. I kind of feel like, you know, he's like a man of, of, of surprises. You know, like, like he, could pro he could probably pull a fast one on you. And you wouldn't know it until it was already too late. But, whatever. I really don't know what that th what that switch does, and I kind of want to go around all the place, you know, kind of hunt for stuff. But now we're going on to even simpler, the um, uh, the map seven of Doom 64. UAC orders were, were to neutralize demonic threat and repower the portal containment air, the portal containment air, containment field. To what end? So they can screw up again? You decide to cross the portal and end this once and for all. As the haze clears, the familiarity of the situation dawns on you. Once, once again you find yourself amiss, uh, amidst. Yeah, pretty much we're now in hell. You know, from 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 this level onwards, we're now in hell because we just pretty much we pretty much crossed the portal or went went through the portal, and you know we pretty much are now in hell. So, I guess. <clears throat> but yeah, even simpler is um. Is known to be like a is known to be kind of like a thing based on Doom 2's Dead Simple, but it can be a bit more chaotic and harder than than that map. Because for one, you have a whole bunch of monkey bites to deal with. Ow. You motherfucker. I know that, and I know that you're not supposed to jump up here or so early, but you know, I've done this so many times. You know, there's nothing nothing too new. But yeah, just like, but yeah, just like in, De but yeah, just like here, and then, De and then Dead Simple in Doom 2. Um, what, what normally would happen is, once you kill all the Minkubi, or Minkubuses, you know, whatever you want to refer to them as, um, some walls will lower down, usually, and you go to get into, like, the areas on, like, the other sides, but, I think, like, also, um, I don't know if it has, like, happened before or after, but also like um, a whole bunch of other enemies spawn here too, like some uh, like some cacodemons, probably some hell knights, and maybe a bear or two or something like that.
just pretty much have like a second, like a second wave scenario. You deal with uh, like a bunch of hell knights and cack demons. Taking out the cacodemons. Well, that oh, <laughs> <coughs> um, this is interesting. Game crash. <laughs> So got an, got an error thing, error expert. Exception caught in main. See crash log dot text for info. Well, shit. Um. Well, this is kind of awkward because I'm doing game capture. <laughs> um. Maverick, if you're if you're willing to stick around, um, I'm going to end my stream real quick, and I'm going to restart it. I'm going to try and do it on. The, I'm going to try to do a uh, area capture thing because if I miss any, if I do anything else, um, it's pretty much going to close my game. And since I'm on game capture, it's also going to be kind of a little bit tricky to um, uh, in, uh, to, to turn off my actions thing. So what? So so yeah. Um, but yeah, just sit tight, everyone, for a little bit. Um, I'm going to restart. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to end my stream right real quick. Um, try and restart it, try and restart this, uh, game and everything. And I'm going to probably try and, uh, see about doing like an area capture. And hopefully I don't have another crash like this. Because I don't know what the hell happened. Uh, it was... I don't know if you can clip that, but that was just that was too funny. Uh, but yeah, I'll be, I'll be right back, everyone.